We're here at Miller's Barbecue. We learned the correct way to say the barbecue today. It's Miller's Barbecue. The big difference with this, with some of the other barbecue places, is the flavoring. This is much more of a peppery flavor, where some of the other places we've got have been much more of a smoky flavor to them. Uh, it's a lot leaner, so if you like your brisket leaner, this is the place to go rather than uh, some of the other places where we've been to where it's been much more fatty. Um, Ambiance, this place, you know, blows it away. It's a gorgeous place inside of here. You really feel the nostalgia when you come into this place. There's awards everywhere, so you know it's good. Uh, and the people here seem to be generally nice, but I, I guess bottom line here with the meat, with the brisket, if you like a leaner cut and if you like more of a peppery brisket uh, instead of a smoky brisket, this is the place to come. I had the brisket and the turkey today. The sausage wasn't ready. Uh, personally, this is our third stop. I'm still snows by far. To me, the best I've ever had. The brisket, we got the lean cut, very good. Uh, a lot of pepper on the on the bark, which is very good. I will give them that. Uh, not as much of a smoke flavor as like the turkey, however, very very good. Very good. Uh, not overly good. Sometimes you can get turkey and it's dry. First of all, best thing, first restaurant so far with big red in the bottle. <laughs> Always welcome at a barbecue place. Um, the brisket is a lot more to my liking. Um, I like really lean brisket. Very good, very lean. Um, still like Snow's better. Snow's had that weird mix of it was very lean but didn't feel as dry as this. Uh, but this is still very good. The turkey is very good. Um, I thought the beans were okay. They are kind of bland though, but. Uh, I mean, they've got a decent taste to them. I've had much worse beans, I'll put it that way. And uh, like I said, the ambiance here is just head and tails so far the best. I mean, you walk into a place, if you're bringing someone who's never been to a Texas barbecue place, this is the definition of a Texas barbecue place. The walls are black. There are awards everywhere. Um, you know, just you feel like you're at a Texas barbecue joint at this place. And I think that's where it really shines is just the atmosphere. And, uh, you know, you walk into the side room and there's a smoky haze just from sitting in here. So um, that's where I think Louis Miller's is uh, tops the chart so far with that. Um, we've tried the, uh, the brisket and the turkey, and I would say that, um, kind of what's been said before here, kind of in agreement, the uh, smoky flavor is less pronounced so than, the, uh, than the, the peppery notes in it, which, which is good for me because I really like pepper. So that's kind of right up my alley. It's good. It's uh, we got the lean cut, which was uh, actually very good. It uh, even though it is lean, it's still very tender and moist. So, uh, just gets good. Uh, the smoked turkey, though, I think is the, the real star here. Um, it's it's flavored well. Um, it, it has uh, again, kind of like the brisket, it's, it's very peppery on the outside, but um, it's, it's 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 cooked wonderfully and um, it, it tastes excellent. So uh, beans, not so much. Nothing to write home about. Uh, but. Uh, but, but, the, uh, but the turkey is definitely worth coming.